Okay, let's start with Bootstrap Navigation Bar. Let's go to Appearance, Settings, Under Components, let's click Nav Bar. There are a few positions we can choose from here. Normal, Static Top, Fixed Top, and Fixed Bottom. We can also inverse the style. Now you can refer to a Bootstrap examples in the getbootstrap.com. Let's go there and find out. Getting started. On the right sidebar here, click on examples. There are many examples here. Let's take a look at navbars in action. Under examples, navbars in action. There are three examples here. Let's open each in different tab and see what's the different. Right click and open a new tab. We do the same to the other two. Let's check it out. Now we can see a navbar original looks in this way. This is also our default bootstrap theme, we call it normal. The second one is navbar static top. You can see the top bar here. It's 100% white with a light gray background color. And the third one is navbar fixed top. Try to scroll down. Now it stick the navigation bar to the top when scrolling down. Okay, back to our Drupal site now. Let's click on the select list here. We have one more option that is fixed bottom. You can try out each option yourself, but we will choose static top. And check the inverse navbar style for a dark background. Scroll down and click save. Now back to the front page. Yep, it looks great now. There's one more thing we need to tweak. If you hover over the admin menu, you will notice the navbar is actually covering your admin menu. Okay, let's check it out. Right click on this navbar and inspect element. Let's check it out on this header. Yes, it's given a class called navbar static top. Now the jack index is 1000. Let's right click on the admin menu and inspect. Let's go to admin menu. Scroll down. Now you will notice the jack index is 999. So we need a greater value than the navbar. Let's open our text editor. To fix this, let's go to Sites, All, Themes, widen this a bit, Bootstrap Subtheme, CSS, Style. Let's make a command here, perhaps we put it as an admin backend. Let's find out what's the class we are going to target. We should be targeting on this admin menu, right? So it's hash admin dash menu. Hash admin dash menu. Right, so we'll give you a jack index column. We use it 9999, right? And semicolon. Save it. Back to our site. And refresh. Let's hover again. Yep, it works. Alright. Great. So let's proceed. 